Hey, welcome on Nick TV. This is a video about uh, air builder. So I'm gonna try to make a new haircut uh, for uh, this new character uh, with air builder uh, air builder uh, plugin. So I got uh, air builder and let's go. So this is a simple uh, haircut. So we'll delete this one and let's uh, try to make. Uh, a nice one so for our builder we need to go inside content just right here air uh, template and uh, we're going to choose element uh, air air builder so i will make a short haircut so let's go to base first and i will choose for this one half up like this so this one, okay. No, the rear one. I will choose uh, this one. Undercut fade. So I get this. Take the light on, okay. And now I will go inside uh, top. Yes, this is top. And I will choose this samurai bun. So double click on it. So you get something like this. So this one I use W key. As you can see, the pivot position is not on the on the pieces. Is right here. So this is not really a problem. So we just move it like this. E for rotation. Adjust the position to the center. I want to make something like this. And maybe a little. Seems good. I will change the position of my character quickly. Uh, maybe uh, in Real Engine 4. Okay. No, I can't go back. So I need it. Uh, I need to center it like this. Seems nice. E for rotation. Like this and move into this position and down. Okay. One more. Click on add to add another one. W key again and move it to the good position. Okay, this one R key to resize it. Something bigger, not too much like this. Up, move it. E for a small rotation. Place it as you wish. Okay, this one seems good. Another one, double kick. Click on Add, Apply, R, R, sorry, for the size, uh, something bigger like this, move, place it, check the position, all seems good, okay, now I'm gonna make, uh, not this one, short ponytail, is it this one, or another one, let's go to Bang, 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 bang. No, this is in top. So I'm gonna choose. I think it's this one. Yes, uh, short. This one. Short ponytail. So double click on it. Click on add. So it's right here. So move it. Move again. E for rotation. W. Place in front like this. Okay. A small rotation E. Move it. Okay. Now I'm going to make it to the to this side. So E for rotation and a little bit like this. Place in the center. Maybe more inside, not too much. And we got something like this. Okay, I will keep it. And now we're gonna make. Let me check. Seems good, seems good, all seems good. Okay, so we're gonna use a pigtail braid. Double click on it. So we got this. And now this is the center one. So W to move it. I'm gonna move it uh, right here. E key to rotation. 
we need to follow the the skull okay the position a little more outside like this the position seems good okay again pigtail brain add apply so this one try to make it in the same position like this e key to rotation so i'm gonna rotate this one like this and i'm gonna move it to the left and inside uh, okay e rotation maybe a little more like this and the, adjust the position place it okay a little more outside not too much e key small rotation okay nice again pick that brain add apply do the same Try to place in the first position like this. E for rotation. Move. Okay. E for rotation like this. Not too much. Adjust the position. Mm, again. Okay. I think I need more rotation this way. So E and rotate a little more. It seems pretty nice. Check. Let's uh, make some check. Maybe more up. More up again. Okay. It seems good. Okay, so I think this haircut is finished. I will. Uh, I want to keep a short haircut for this one. Uh, can I add something? Mm, maybe, maybe not. <coughs> if you want to add... Uh, I don't know if we can add something. Uh, go to base. Maybe we can add another half up. We're gonna try. Double click. Add. So it's right here. So use the W key to move it. E for rotation. Okay, place it. E for rotation, maybe more like this. R to resize it more flat. So as you can see, we can add some hair this way and in the same, if we want. This is not, uh, this is, I think it's pretty nice. Not the best, but uh, it's pretty nice. Light off, okay, light on. Okay, you know why? I will remove this one. I think it's uh, too much. So remove. And I will keep this haircut. So uh, no, if you want to change the color, you just have to select one piece of the hair, go to modify, material, and you can change uh, here in strand color, you, the color you want, the root color, the end color. But if you don't want to change too much the color, and if you want to be this easily, it's pretty simple. Go in content. Go inside. Where is it? It's a stage element. Yes, stage element. Uh, material. No, material plus. Yes. Air builder. And so remember, this is a base air right here. So go to base. Uh, here, uh, I think this is half up. Yes, and you get um, the base color. This is material base. So 
She's um, she's a dark errand woman. You can see by the ice bro right here. So I'm gonna choose not this one, not this one. Uh, maybe maybe we can make it yes this one. Let's try this one. So you just put on it. Apply. Hmm. I don't like this color. Maybe in grey. Okay. Okay, this is the same color as her eyes, so we keep this one. And now I do the same for the other. So the other one are all in top. So go in top. So curly ponytail, this is not this one. For this one. This is pigtail braid. And let me show you. Take only one, put on only one, apply, and all the same goes the same uh, material. Like this. Okay? No, this one. So this one is a samurai bun. Up. Apply. Okay. This one is a uh, rear. So is here and this is undercut fade and this one. Okay, and this one is uh, is not a bang, is a top. So this is a top and this is a, a small uh, small something. Messy ponytails? No, not this one. Short ponytail. Yes, that's this one. And apply. And my haircut is finished. So I stop the light. It's doing something like this. Okay. Uh, now, if I want to change the color uh, for something more darker, who is not inside the material, go to modify, select one pieces, like uh, this one, this pieces, material, and here you get the many options. So the first is train color. I repeat, root color, end color. Okay. Uh, I will change the end color quickly. So I want something uh, orange, as you can see. Dark brown. Okay. So cancel. I will just keep this one. And if you want to colorize quickly, this is a light uh, color. So it's easy. To go in diffuse color, it's very easy to go in diffuse color and just change the diffuse color directly and you got the color you want. So I want um, dark red for this uh, for this one. So okay. Uh, if I want to keep this color, I just uh, on it and just add custom color. She's right here. And now I just take this one and do the same. It's right here. This one. Uh, okay. This one, diffuse color, right here. This one, diffuse color, here. This pieces, diffuse color. You can keep the original material if you want. So this is this one, and what is it? Diffuse color, here. So for this one, it's a special, but I will finish the, the other before. So diffuse color, this one, diffuse color here, diffuse color here. Okay, so this part is a special, just right here. So if I go, is uh, is in two pieces, this cap and the air. So this cap is already in diffuse color black. I will choose no under fade air and the same diffuse color, this one. And that's it. And I get my uh, dark RM. So now I will just save it. So I just click on my avatar, not on the RPC, but on my avatar. I can change the position to something like, uh, uh, like this. Okay. She's wearing her new hair. So I go inside content, I go inside air, I go inside custom style and I take my pictures, so 
Something like this. Okay. Plus. Uh, sorry. In English is add. I rename it. So this is. Uh, um, I think this is another three. Okay. And now let me show you. Go inside the uh, iClone 7. Right here. She's right here. Change her position. Tac, 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 tac. Motion. So I want to pause. Something sexy. Mm, this one. <laughs> no. Something simple. Uh, maybe. This one. Okay. So she's right here. And now go simply inside custom character uh, inside body part go to air and find the style folder and your new air is right here it's synchronized with the um, character header free so double click on it and it applied the new air cut and voila she's wearing her new air cut just wait here. And you get physics on air, of course. Let's change the position of the character. Uh, sign up. This one. So we get the air cut. As you can see, the new haircut, and you can change the color uh, when you want. It's pretty simple, and I think you have the same material directly here inside iClone Seven. So you can change the material directly inside iClone Seven, and we save. So I think it's in mm, this one. Package no media yes material. Uh, no, Material Plus, yes, Material Plus, Air Builder, um, top, and as you can see, you can change, you get the same material as the uh, character at of three directly inside the clone 7. So, you don't have to return inside the uh, character at of three to change the color of your new haircut. You can directly change it inside iClone if you want. And if you change it, uh, to this one, for example, let me show you. I will just change the back. So, as you can see, it changed, but remember, we just change the um, diffuse color. So, select the three parts, go to modify, and where is it? Ah, we need to, we need to take it one by one. Okay, so I take this part right here. Sorry, this one, this braid. So remember, uh, we are in diffuse color, so you just have to full white and you and you restart the original color. Like this, full white. And this one, full white. Okay, so if you want to make a green air, pink air, uh, anything you want, uh, you just have to first unselect all, select your character, go to content, Go back to character. Here, come back to custom, air, style, and here, take the pictures. Something like this. We can see the both color and just plus. And it will save. Where is it? Yes, as you can see, uh, this is uh, style 1.2. It will save the new one just right here. And if you come back inside character creator 3, it's just right here too. Okay? So once you made your home haircut inside character creator 3, you can modify the color uh, directly inside icon 7 if you want. This is not a problem. So I will just delete this one because uh, I don't like this one. I will keep the new one, this one. I like it. And if I delete it inside Character Creator 3, it will delete automatically to Icon 7. Same. Okay? So, this is the end of this video. I will keep uh, the, this one. 
because it's better. This one is more, uh, it's more nice. Okay, so it is done, as you can see. She's wearing her new haircut. And voila, it's finished. Thanks for watching and good luck to create your own haircut. Bye bye.